Mayo is going to ascend quickly because of the success of D'Amico and the success of Dan Campbell and the success of these ex-players who of, of Vrabel, you know, so like, I think if you say no, if you walk away from Mayo now, like you're not getting that back. And I think that's part of the equation too. Mayo's going to be the guy. I think so too. And Mayo's obviously going to be amenable to, to, uh, you know, who, who having input, who was, you know, uh, general manager is going to be, who was coach is going to be on his coaching staff. I'm, I'm wondering, you know, Vrabel, does he, I think Gerard, I think Gerard is a, I think Gerard's a special coaching prospect, but I use the word prospect. Okay. So you don't know what he's going to be as a head coach, but I think he has special qualities that aren't unlike the qualities that Mike Vrabel has Mm -hmm. that, that, um, that D'Amico Ryans has that Dan Campbell has that Kevin O'Connell has his ex players. And I just think like all you guys, right? Like you guys were easier to win over. I think 20, 30 years ago. Cause we all came from the, we're going to do it. Cause they said so generation, this generation is different. And I think what's really hard to get with this generation is engagement. And so a Mike McDaniel has to fight for engagement, right? These guys have got that hurdle clear. They, they walk in and it, have it. That hurdle is cleared. Right, like, they can so, screw it up, but they are given the that respect right yeah. out of the gate. And I remember having this conversation with Vrabel a few years ago. It was the first year he was there in eighteen, right? Mm-hmm. And I asked him, I said, like, well, you've only been coaching for seven years. Is there anything that yeah? Oh. And he looked at me like I had five heads. He only played in the league fifteen. And he years, goes, so. "What? So my fifteen years set in the edge doesn't count?" <laughs> and he's like, "So some guy over here was sitting in dark rooms while I was rushing the passer, and that's more valuable." And he's right. Trod Mayo was like freaking calling the defense here for what? Seven years, you know? So that counts too. So I, 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 I would, I would be for them hiring Mike Vrabel. I would be for them hiring Gerard Mayo.